Hey guys, welcome back to another unboxing video. And today in this video, I'll be unboxing a brand new line called the Strong Chains. And this line includes four figures. So it includes this Krillin I'm gonna unbox for you guys today. It includes a Goku, a Vegeta, and then a Master Roshi. And this is one of the brand new lines that had just been, re been released from the Ichibancho. And as you guys can see on the bottom left, it's also Master Light. So it is gonna be a really good figure kind of tall good weight size figure as all the master lights are and without further ado let's get to the unboxing of the figure for you guys And there we are guys, Krillin from the Dragon Ball Super Series. Now, well, the expectations just went off the, the roof. This is actually a really small figure. But then again, Krillin is small, so it's understandable. I believe that when I unbox the Vegeta and Goku, they'll at least stand at least this tall to the Krillin. So I'm not really that upset or disappointed about this, but it is kind of a letdown. The at least made the box a little bit smaller. And, um... Yeah, I should've told you guys, the box didn't have no weight at all, so I kind of figured that the figure was gonna be like this. So I didn't think it was gonna be this, you know, this small. But again, Krillin is small, so it's understandable. Nonetheless, it's actually a good figure. This is my first Krillin figure. I've not seen many Krillins out there as much the same as I haven't seen any Yamchas. So with this being the first Krillin in my collection, is actually really nice, especially since it is a Master Lies. You can see from all the details, his little arms, you can see the great muscles. He's still a good fighter, still a good martial artist, so of course to do the details right on. His bald head. One thing I don't like about having seen like a, having a bald character is that you can see the line where they put the head together. You guys can see when they when they produced it or when they created it manufactured there you can see this and that i believe all figures have it but they're just all covered by the hair that they have except krillin because he's bald nonetheless great details on krillin i don't have to really do a 360 because i can just turn him like this but let's do it anyway he says it's really tiny really tiny so tiny let me give you guys a, com a size comparison from him and Yancho that I previously unboxed. This is Yamcha and this is Krillin 2 Yamcha. It's understandable that Yamcha is this side only because he's doing his wolf thing fist. So he's essentially crouching, meeting Krillin's height. This is Krillin standing up and he's just so tiny. It's still a good, still a good line though. I'm really hyped for the Vegeta and Goku because they have some good weight to them. Nonetheless, this Krillin, let me give you guys a quick close-up of him. 
And it's so cute that he has his own little baby stand. Like the stand is so small. Here we go, you can see the creases in the pants and his shirt, so clothing. See the line I mentioned earlier and his bald head. Don't really like that, but no one will be able to see it when I put him anywhere. So tiny. Here we go. And the great detail of the muscles in his arms, the contractions. They should at least make the box a little bit smaller. Nonetheless, being a new figure for me, a new figure of Krillin, not having Krillin is a really great figure. I don't know thoughts. I like this figure. Wish they made him a little bigger, but that's how Krillin is again, so I can't really get bummed out about it. They should at least make the box a little bit smaller. They made the box as big as the Goku and the Vegeta box, which I'll show really quick. So here's the Vegeta box, still in the packaging. You can see just that the Vegeta's box is big as Krillin's. So that's what gave me hope that Krillin will be at least a little bit bigger. But nonetheless, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me unboxing this Krillin from the Strong Change line, which I was really hyped for. I still am hyped for to unbox uh, Goku, Vegeta, and the Master Roshi. I don't have a Master Roshi in my collection either, so he will be the first, which is very exciting for me. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Really, really hope you guys enjoyed me unboxing this criminal for you guys as much as I did have way more unboxing videos for you guys I keep hoping to get the new figures that just released for you guys at least overseas at least for the United States and um, yeah thank you guys and I'll see you guys in the next one thank you very much Thank <laughs> you.